I help businesses, freelancers learn chatbot marketing for their business to increase their leads and conversions. My name is DJ Dadula and I am the Marketing DJ. Subscribe to my channel and enjoy. All right, so that's the rep URL. And what you need to do is uh, we'll go to another growth tool called uh, Facebook um, Ads JSON. So Facebook Ads JSON is a, a growth tool where we will use this for uh, Facebook ads. So we, we won't be diving deep on this part because this is a special tool where you want to integrate your bot uh, for a Facebook ad. So if you if you don't know how to, you know, operate a Facebook ad, uh, I suggest you go to a, a video in YouTube and then look for a Facebook ads on Messenger campaign. But right right now, I will show you how you can do that in Botcake. So what we need to do is select select a flow like this one, the same flow that we'll be doing. So create a JSON ad and then we will select the opt-in and after we select opt-in it says here you cannot update content after activating the tool if there is a need to edit the opt-in content for running ad please create a new JSON ads tool so it's just it basically says here that you cannot edit the first part actually the first part of the flow if you change that then the whole ad will change so if we go to next step you should see a code, a series of code here. Don't worry. You don't have to know a code or how to, how to code anything here. But in case you don't see this yet, we need to save this first. So if we click save, then we should see this code. All right. So just remember here, the message should not have any attributes. So an attribute actually uh, is a calling a, a variable inside Botcake. Um, if you see your name here in the flow, we've created a, uh, a first name maybe. That's the um, attribute. So it, you don't want to put anything here, but just plain text. So we will, we will uh, uh, be, you know, diving deep on that part on the next series but for now we just have to copy this copy that and we will use that for facebook ads so i pull up here a uh, ads manager where if you're familiar with creating ads this is how it looks like but if you just new on ads manager i suggest you research or watch uh, other videos this but if you want to simplify things just follow this video and uh, i'll show you how you can you know get this code into your ad so first things first we want to create in a campaign and we will select messages for this so you click continue and then we will uh it will create a new ad set and then we will not focus on ad set, but we'll make sure that the destination is messenger. And then after that, we want to go to the new ad. So make sure we have selected the page that we'll be using to advertise. And then uh, this one, if you don't have Instagram, then use the selected page. So we will, it says here that you need to run ad for this type. So we will select a media. We will select an image here. And we will try to find any stock photos. So Facebook is amazing that you can use any stock photo for free. So let's say this is our ad. So that's our copy there. And what we need to focus is this part, the message template. This is where we will put our JSON ad code so we can integrate our bot. So we will go to advanced setup and then click edit. And then notice that uh, it, it's, it's similar to what Botcake you know, provided us. But you can see in the JSON setup, you can see the output here. This is what Facebook made, but we just want to select the first part. Then click select all or control A and then delete those. Then after that, we will paste 
our code here it says here that inline previews are not currently supported that's fine it's because it's not from facebook but it's from another platform but actually we can test this message out so if i click preview in message we can see the message in our bot using our messenger here it says uh hello this is my content so that's the 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 content where we set up bot cake so if you want to change that it's a fine but you need to consider that the code will change as well so we will select okay so we, we can select if it's saved already so we want to make another one um no, there's something weird there but actually we we should see this code here if we click message again preview the message there you go so we got the right message so i think the other one is just uh the the last uh, testing that uh happened so so this one is our json where we have hello world then choose a button below all right so take note of that that in order for us to do this we need to delete what facebook has here and then paste the code that we copied from botgate and then after that you know save and finish and then publish your ad All right so that's how you can easily uh, create a, a, a json ad so another growth tool actually is the qr code so to create a qr code it's the same thing as ref url and json ad we need the message destination we will select the same flow here and then we will go to ne the next step and then facebook will let you generate this automatically so a qr code is the same thing like you know paying your bills uh paying to a grocery store or you know a coupon code same thing here but you have the ability to uh adjust the sizes a uh, thousand so this one is it will this one will uh generate you know a cl more clear or a detailed you know look if you download a hundred pixel it's just very small but if you want to print it out like a clear image then you might want to use 1000 then you just have to download that image and there you go you have that image already so you can you know print it out to your product label or in your table maybe if you're a restaurant and in any shop or any website that you want in, in your id or any paper like a menu or anything you can print this out so that when people scan this, then it will go to this message. This is really powerful to increase the offline to online sales using the QR code. And it's really, really easy to use. And it's really powerful as well because, you know, a lot of people using their mobile phone, you know, if they go to the restaurant or any shops, uh, they use QR code already. And then most uh, phones right now have a QR scanner. But if you don't have, you can, you know, you can search, you can create a, uh, a label or an instruction that they can, you know, they can search for a QR code maybe. So I think you can just see it from the mobile. Let's say you want to wanna go to Facebook and then let's say QR code scanner. All right so if i want to demo it this one the blue one is the qr code scanner from facebook so i hope you you are seeing this let me check that yeah you're seeing that code and then we will scan this one Make sure you're far boom there you go it opens the messenger and then it will open the flow that we just made right so that's it that's the success that we have try it and let me know in the comments if you tried this growth tool it's really really amazing so the last growth tool the last last growth tool i'll be showing you is the customer chat the customer chat will look like this and you can you know see it in a, a website all right 
so i'll be pulling up a uh, website builder uh, but uh this will be uh, another content but this website builder is uh free to use right now all right so for example we will um open a webcake editor so basically um what you need to do is for example this is our website so i just put you know hello world and then let me click this and then i'll go to uh, others so any website builder has an html box for just you know free code i can you know delete this and we go back to our growth tools so if we click next step we will we should see this you know uh j set up java so in order for us to complete this setup up make sure your website you add your website with an https uh, in our url a complete um secured website so if you have like http only it will not work so make sure you have https in your website so in this case since this is a, a testing website i'm using uh, a, a shared url okay so i'll be using webcake.io here and then i added it already and then click add and it will say success and then we will go to the setup javascript so don't worry you don't have to know a lot of things here but you know you just have to copy then after we copy we will go back to our html box and then just paste it there and click update i just have to publish this and then i'll just click the link that i have just made and right now if we save it save like that we will now see a messenger uh, a chat box here so i click refresh again and then it will automatically pop up like this one it will say hey continue as your name in facebook or continue as guest so from here you can communicate directly to your bot or to a website so from this uh, stage imagine that you have a website that you have a lot of products and services here and then in some time people got lost but you want them you want to help them you know to increase your conversions you need them to be your lead so you just want to make this in your website and this will come out to uh, them and then you, they can continue here or ask you your support or uh, just click a product directly from their website all right so that's about it and uh, that's how we want to grow subscribers using the grow tools in botcake see you on the next video and the next one would be um, available in the description also below or you can check out after this video see you next time thank you very much again for watching and learning with my channel make sure to hit subscribe and if you have a time please like this button like this video and share your thoughts in the comments below all the links and uh, you know possible uh, resources and uh, groups are in the description for you designed for you to learn and engage with us see you on my next video again and thank you very much